Well, Happy New Year to everyone out there in the virtual landscape. Welcome to 2021 and another year of adversity and adventure, not unlike any other year recorded in the many pages of the Bible. My name is Chris Bowles, and I have discovered over the last year a deeper appreciation for Scripture. When we first had to close the church and figure out a way of doing virtual church, the most important thing to me was that we gather around God's Word. The start of a new year is the start of new beginnings, and what better thing to commit ourselves to than daily Bible reading? There are many resources to help us out with this, including Bible apps for our phones, reading plans to help set goals, and study Bibles to help us get a deeper understanding of what we are reading. One great way to hear the Word of God is through the Word of the Lord Endures Forever podcast with Pastor Will Whedon. It is a 15-minute verse-by-verse daily Bible study that you can check out at thewordendures.org. Thanks to the following people for sharing God's Word with us Sunday mornings either in person or via video message this past year, including Ron Moore, Terry Hirsch, Derek Mathers, Roger Ellis, Dushan Toth, Greg Lutz, Jason Gillard, Ted Radke, James Anderson, and Randy Shaw. And thanks also to Pastor Marcus Keene for visiting our members and giving them communion, and to Pastor Derek Mathers for opening the doors to the church for communion. Thanks also to our readers this past year who kept us connected through God's Word each week. This includes Deanna Krause, Steve Fister, Jean Slimmon, Sylvia Vladder Scott, Ann Shikoff, Rick McPhee, Ed McCullough, Sue Cinerine, and Kevin Michener. A big thanks also to the following for their assistance in keeping us connected via our online services. Clarice Lamb, who faithfully provided him videos for virtual services. Randy Scholl, who got us started on our virtual journey with Google Slides and provided other special video content. Kevin Michener, who recorded special video for online VBS and other occasions, sermons for pastors, and audio recordings for our reading each week. Thanks also for video recording services once we were back in person. Rick McPhee for worship song suggestions to include in our video playlist for the services. And Shikov and Kevin and Lyndon Mitchner for putting together our virtual VBS. Thanks and gratitude to our church council, the elders and trustees for navigating all the policy changes this past year and creating a safe environment for us to join together these past few months to worship in person. This includes Steve Cinerine, Karen Stickle, Jonathan Huris, Peter Cinerine, Dial Persaud, Luke Kang, Steve McDonald, Rob Scott, Cornelia Pixner, Leslie Colley, and Daniel Huris. Thanks to our special missions committee, Glenn Colley, Pauline Hennig, Deanna Kraus, Jean Slimmon, Sylvia Vladder Scott, Nancy Kirk, and all the ladies that work behind the scenes. A special thanks to Cornelia Pixner and Linda Mitchner and all the other volunteers who helped decorate the church for the Christmas season. I apologize if I've left anyone out. A special thanks to all our members for sticking together throughout this very challenging year. Emmanuel, God with us. For I am sure that neither death nor life, nor angels nor rulers, nor things present, nor things to come, nor powers, nor height, nor depth, nor anything else in all creation will be able to separate us from the love of God in Christ Jesus our Lord. Romans 8, 38-39. God bless you as you worship and serve him in 2021.